Welcome to another instructional video from OWL, the wise choice in fiber optic test equipment. I'm Professor Jim Powers. The FiberL 4 volt is one of the most economic fiber optic link certification power meters on the market today, delivering professional performance and a complete set of features for users who need to certify fiber links against popular cabling standards with pass-fail results right in the field and produce professional fiber certification reports. This video will cover some of the key features that are useful when evaluating the fiber out 4 bolt for purchase, as well as some typical fiber test applications the fiber out 4 bolt can be used for. OWL's factory is located in the heartland of America. With operations located in the U.S., OWL has developed an excellent track record for quality, affordability, and product support. Like other OWL optical power meters and light sources, the fiber out 4 bolt is NIST traceable. NIST which stands for National Institute of Standards and Technology, is a U.S. government lab that maintains official calibration equipment for fiber optics in the U.S. NIST traceability means that product calibration can be traced back to government calibration standards, assuring users that test results are as accurate and precise as possible. Being a small, lightweight, handheld device, the FiberL 4 bolt is equally suited for testing in any location, whether it be in a datacom closet or up on a lift. And, for increased durability, the unit is enclosed in a protective rubber boot. The FiberL 4 bolt is powered by a standard 9-volt battery located near the bottom of the unit. To locate the battery cover, simply remove the boot by pressing uh, the back of the boot like this and prying the bottom of the boot off. And you can see the battery cover is located near the bottom of the unit here. Now, to access the battery, we'll need a Phillips screwdriver to remove the battery cover. A single battery will provide 100 plus hours of continuous operation, and an auto shutoff feature further increases battery life. All takes an innovative approach with the fiber out 4 bolt, giving users a choice between two operating modes. Now, when you boot the meter up, uh, it'll show a screen like this, showing different operating modes. A uh, simple meter will be highlighted by default. A uh, simple meter mode allows the meter to operate like any other basic power meter with quick and easy optical power and loss measurement capability uh, when storing data points is not really a necessity. In certification meter mode, however, users can use OWL's Link Wizard to set up the meter for pass-fail fiber link certification right in the field. Seeing pass-fail on the screen is a huge advantage. Knowing uh, up front if a link is failing allows the user to try to fix the fiber before continuing. In addition, the tech support option shows OWL's contact information, including phone number and URL in any case where support issues arise in the field. Uh, the 18-button keypad gives users a way to easily enter alphanumeric fiber job and link information, as well as navigate through the FiberOWL's menu system. The FiberOWL 4 bolt includes a universal port system that allows connection to popular fiber connectors. As you can see here, uh, you'll see that it says detector on, on the top of the display there. In this case, we have a uh, adapter cap for 2.5 millimeter connectors, such as ST and SC. Here. So here's a, an ST connector. an SC connector. As you can see, uh, the universal port system allows connection to multiple connector types in the same port. However, OWL also uses a, uh, a 1.25 millimeter adapter cap for connection to LC, MU, and other small form factor connectors. Simply unscrew one adapter and you screw on the other adapter. As you can see, this adapter has a smaller a smaller uh, port here. This is where we will we'll plug in our LC connector. The second port on the FiberL 4 bolt is dedicating to measure the length of an optical fiber link. As you can see, it's this caution light source. Uh, this is for length measurement only. You will not use this for any sort of loss measurement. Now, the length of an optical fiber is a very important for determining the certification link budget. Uh, you need to measure the length because you need to know how much 
loss you are allowed to have for that particular length of optical fiber. Okay, one of the first applications that the fiber aisle 4 bolt can be used for is to measure active equipment optical power. Simply connect the fiber aisle to the transmit port for near end output power measurement or connect through the link to check receiver sensitivity at the far end of the link. In addition, when bundled with a multi-mode and or single mode light source as a test kit, the fiber aisle 4 bolt can also be used for checking continuity or for testing patch cables. Most users, however, will use the fiber aisle 4 bolt to certify fiber links against popular cabling standards. Fiber link certification requires an additional light source, so test kit options are available for multi-mode and or single mode fiber link certification. As more and more fiber networks are installed, especially premise networks, Fiber link certification has become a feature that no cable installer should go without. Not only are customers increasingly demanding printed certification reports for their fiber installations, certification reports are also proof of an installer's job well done in case of disputes. Fiber all four bolt test kits offer four key advantages over test kits that do not offer fiber link certification. First, there are several popular current cabling standards built right in, including the TIA, ISO, and Ethernet standards. So, no matter what current cabling standard your customer requests, you can certify their fiber links. The fiber all can also be configured with user-definable standards, or users can enter their own custom link budget. Next is the measurement of end-to-end -end length of a fiber link. One of the key parameters of any certification link budget is knowing how much loss is allowed for the optical fiber in the link under test. Thus, it is important to be able to determine the end-to-end -end length of the optical fiber. The Fiber All 4 bolt includes an optical length tester dedicated to measuring the end-to-end -end length of optical fiber. Third is pass-fail or test results right in the field. Using predefined cabling standards means no more guesswork or wondering if the link is good or not. You'll know right away without the hassle of manually calculating your link budget. And finally, the Fiber All 4 bolt includes data storage and printed test results. As we have seen, the customers are requiring test reports for their own records. However, many of these customers are also applying for long-term manufacturer cabling system warranties. These cabling system manufacturers require standards-based certification test results as a part of granting these long-term warranties. For more information about the Fiber Owl 4 bolt, visit OWL's website at the following location. This has been another instructional video from OWL, the wise choice in fiber optic test equipment. For more information about additional instructional videos or OWL fiber optic test equipment in general, please visit OWL's website at owl-inc.com. I'm Professor Jim Powers. Thanks for watching.